whole season trip, you know what I mean? And um, we just got to really use, especially this last couple months to kind of just really understand how severe and how, you know, crucial the game comes now for all, everybody in the NFL is fighting for some type of playoff spot. So, you know, all the chips are on the table and we, we got to really ball out and, and, and recover. Right. Um, well, I don't know. Um, you know, we just going out here to, you know, try to continue to just help watch the film. You know, the coach is going to give us those stats. But, you know, uh, all things came up. I think we had a few, two picks in the first first half. You gotta go back to the drawing board. Yeah. On Monday, we'll see what's yeah, going on. Yeah, because most times you're so used to. Yeah, most times you're used to just playing with gaps. Everybody got a gap. You just play with gaps. You play with a gap. That's what should be all right. You know, the complication is this. Maybe sits there, sits there, sits there, and you're just waiting for somebody to come in and just go in the opposite direction. So uh, we got to throw our hat to our coach. Got to spend our hand with him and be willing to be ready for that attack. Corey, there no, was not some really. Um, obviously, we had a lot of different packages, special teams packages, and things like that. So when they change personnel, we were trying to change personnel. But um, for the most part, I, I mean, me personally, and we, we, we didn't really have any issues with that. It might have been a last second when Chris Hunter switched up at the last second as far as personnel and things like that, but it wasn't really an issue at all. I mean, obviously, the man had, I don't know how many yards. Um, that's it? Um, he had 230-something yards, so obviously it makes it a lot, a lot tougher. Um, it's tough.